We're first at 6 o'clock, Myrtle Beach City leaders look ahead to what 2022 has in store for their city. And they shared their vision with News 13's Manny Martinez, who is live in Myrtle Beach right now with what leaders said they hope for this year. Manny. Bob and Megan, good evening. Both Mayor Brenda Bethune and City Council Member Greg Smith are optimistic about the new year, adding that 2022 is the perfect time to get started on new key projects like increasing workforce housing options, as well as continuing to work on downtown revitalization, all while trying to make sure the city is fully staffed. It's an exciting time for the city. We have so many positive things happening. Myrtle Beach Mayor Brenda Bethune starts her second term in office later this month. She says 2021 was a banner year for the city with record tourism, serving as a springboard for 2022, where a focus will be sustaining that momentum. That in turn helps our businesses, it helps our residents. Um, we need our businesses to thrive. Council Member Greg Smith says the best way to keep the ball rolling is not necessarily to attract more people, but to have them choose Myrtle Beach all 12 months of the year, which is why the city put on a winter wonderland at the beach. We need to spread them out. You know, we're, we're full during the summer. Let's um, add some people in, in the shoulder months and in the off season so we can uh, spread it out to, to less of a, a roller coaster ride of business. In 2022, Bethune says her top priorities are continuing to build on what she and council have already started so that come January 2023. We have some really great workforce housing projects underway. That's a huge need in this area. I hope that we have a police force that is fully staffed and has all of the resources that they need. And I hope that we see some more things in the Arts and Innovation District really under construction and coming online. And city council and city staff will have more specifics as to what they can do, what they can afford to do the second half of this year after a budget retreat in late February. Live in Myrtle Beach, Manny Martinez, News 13.